Hello everybody, so in today's video I will be going through the process of installing Homebrew Package Manager for macOS environment. So let's get to it. Okay, so to install Homebrew, all you have to do is go to your browser and search for Homebrew. And this is the website that we will be using to install Homebrew, this is uh, brew.sh. So this is the website that we will be using. And before we go into the installation process, just quickly, Homebrew, if you're not familiar with it, is a free and open source software package management system that simplifies the installation of software and Apple's operating system. So that's the definition. So this basically means that once you install Homebrew, you can leverage it and use it to install other tools and applications to your Mac environment. Okay, so we will be going ahead and install this on our Mac OS environment. So to do this, uh, all you have to do again is just uh, click here and you can open it on a new tab. So and that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to open it on a new tab. And uh, as you can see here, what you have to do is just paste this command. Just copy this command and paste it uh, onto your terminal. But before we do this, let's just go ahead and uh, check if we have homebrew installed in our environment so to do that i uh, just go ahead and open terminal and let's execute this command uh, called brew so this is the command that you will install that comes with homebrew and once you install it so brew and let's check uh, the fashion okay so you can see here it says that um, this command is not found so this means that we currently do not have Homebrew installed in our Mac OS environment. So let's go ahead then and, and install it. Okay. So I'm going to minimize this and we are going to copy this. So I'm just going to hit this thing here, copy this, and we will go back to our terminal and paste it. Okay. And then all we have to do is just click enter. All right. So this is going to ask us to enter our password so this will be the password that we use to log into our macbook so i'm just going to do that all right and there we go so the installation process has begun and it's saying here to just press like that just press any key i guess uh, for me i just pressed return to continue with the installation process okay all right so this one is installing now Okay, and we can see here it's done. So let's see if we can run the brew command. So I'm going to do that brew and I'm going to check the fashion. Okay, so as you can see here, it's still not recognized. So one thing that we will need to do for this to be able to work is to add brew into our path. Okay, so to do that, I am going to copy this command that helps us to add a brew into our environment variables okay so brew is installed in opt homebrew and under pin directory that is that is where we have homebrew installed so all you have to do is just copy this command and i'm going to put this in the description so that you can use it just copy going to copy this and i'm going to paste it in my terminal okay so i'm going to paste it right here like so and end it okay so we are now able to add homebrew into our path and then the next thing that we need to do now is check if brew is installed so we can go ahead and run again fashion brew fashion and there we go so we can see that brew now is installed and we can run brew commands okay guys that's all i wanted to show you in this video i hope the video was helpful if you have not subscribed to the channel please do subscribe so that you can stay updated for our next videos all right bye bye